So you have a little piece of homework today. As you go out and someone asks you, why are you wearing a piece of thread on your wrist? Please be sure to tell them. It's because I have learned today about Paraguay and about Chile. And at church, I learned that we are connected with people all the way around the world. And as we close, we'd like to invite you to sing with us the servant song, which is in. others and bringing others in. 
So we're going to turn around and face out of our circle, and we're going to count in our heads, one, two, three, and then we're all going to shout together, Shalom. Now, when we do this at the Shalom Center, if we shout loud enough, then the Andes Mountains respond with their echo. I don't think we can shout loud enough tonight for it to bounce off the Andes Mountains, but we sure can shout it loud enough to remind ourselves that we are the ones that are to carry Shalom out. So turn back around into the circle, and now we're going to pray. I'm going to pray, and then at the end, we'll do the closing um, Shalom prayer. So I want you to hold hands now with your left hand facing palm up. Okay, face your left hand, palm up, and now take the other hand, your right hand, on top. So now, there you go. Everybody got that? Now I want you to feel for just a moment the different sensations of holding hands, this hand and this hand. One hand might be warmer, one might be colder. <laughs> one might be thinner, one might be thicker. But I also want you to think a little bit about how we support each other and we are also supported. To build shalom in humility, sometimes we are the ones offering our gifts and sustaining others, and sometimes we're the ones receiving our gifts from others and being sustained. And this is the way we do mission work around the world at the United Church of Christ. We recognize that sometimes we're the ones that are giving, and we recognize that sometimes we're the ones that are sustained and receiving. Let us pray. Dear Lord, we thank you so much for the opportunity to be here tonight. We thank you because you give us the freedom to be able to meet in this church building. We know that the building represents so many faithful that have gone on before us. We also know, Lord, that the building is not the church because we are the church. We are your body stretched all the way around the world in a circle big enough and open enough to receive anyone. We pray, Lord, that you might take us from this circle to share your shalom, your peace and justice and mercy and truth to whoever needs it. To those dark corners around us, send us with your light. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen.